There's a green rise. It was actually I think it was a 48. It was in between the first and second floor in a all space sort of thing. That must have kind of local there then. Well, it's open to the eaves. Oh, we got through it. Surprise. <laughs> yeah. That was last year, so this is a whole new year. Yeah, no week so far this year, right? Do we have any residents on Zoom? On Zoom? No. All staff. The John K is John Conway. Okay. I'm going to waive my usual reading, and if everybody's ready, we'll call the meeting to order. So would you please join me, rise for a moment of silence, followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. And now the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. One nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <coughs> okay, our first item up is uh, reorganization of the board. Uh, we'll start with chairman. Uh, we need a nomination for chairman. I nominate W. Scott Wigglesworth for chairman. Mr. Bennett uh, nominates myself, W. Scott Wigglesworth for chairman. Is there a second? Second. Second for Mr. Russell. Is there any discussion? Okay. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Okay. Motion carries five to zero. Okay. Up next, vice chairman, I'd like to nominate Mr. Tom Bennett, is there a second? Second. Second for Mr. Weaver. Any discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion carries five to zero. Thank you. Up next, we have the consent agenda for the annual appointments. It looks like they're uh, separated out here um, under uh, first under staff. Do we need to take each one of these letters individually or can this be one? You can adopt the entire consent agenda if the board agrees. Okay. So is there any discussion on this? Any, any questions? There's quite a few appointments here. I just want to make sure that we don't I want to give everybody an opportunity if they have an issue to, to speak up. Mr. Chairman, I would move for approval of the consent agenda item three letters A through R as prepared in the agenda. Okay, motion to approve the consent agenda for Mr. Lefevre. Is there a second? Second. Second for Mr. Bennett. Any discussion? All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? <clears throat> motion carries five to zero. Okay, up next we have resolutions uh, for the zoning hearing board. It looks like we have one candidate uh, to consider. Any comments or discussions on the reappointment of John Bingham? And we did confirm that he does want to serve. We did, yes, okay. he does. Okay, hearing none, uh, is there a motion to approve resolution number 2023-01, appointing John Bingham to the Zoning Hearing Board? So moved. 
A motion for Mr. Lefevre. Is there a second? Second. Second for Mr. Bennett. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion carries five to zero. Okay. Up next, uh, sewage enforcement officer reappointment of Ratu Associates and Marvin Stone and Marvin Stoner as the alternate. Uh, that would be resolution 2023-02. Is there any discussion on this item? Okay. Hearing none, is there a motion? to adopt resolution 2023-02, reappointing with two associates and Marvin Stoner, alternate as a sewage enforcement officer. So moved. Motion for Mr. Bennett, is there a second? Second. Second for Mr. Weaver. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion carries five to zero, thank you. Okay. Up next, we have the um, preservation of farmland resolution. I believe this is just an acknowledgement of resolution 13-07. Uh, um, designating the board's historical and current intention to protect farmland and to protect and promote agricultural and agricultural businesses in East Enfield Township to preserve prime agricultural farmland and to preserve both the rural and agricultural character in the areas of the township generally referred to as north of 283. As the most associated member of the board with that area, I am pleased to move for approval. Okay. Um, so again, it's just an acknowledgement. So we're just voting to acknowledge it. Um, Motion by Mr. Lefevre to acknowledge res resolution 1307. Is there a second? I'll second it. And the reason we do this each year, it's just adopted in 2013, is to provide developers and property owners a better understanding of the intent of the board before they purchase properties with the intent of potentially rezoning. That's really what drives this most resolution so that we are character we're basically telegraphing our intent in that area to be fair to all people involved. So that's the reason behind it. And I'll, I'll second that. Okay. Motion by Mr. Russell. Any other comments? Okay, hearing none, all those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion carries five to zero. Up next, our fee schedule. Some of the minor adjustments that were made to the fee schedule are noted on the far right of your document. Um, as we were reviewing them last year or the year before, it took several months to get that accomplished. Um, and then errors were made. So this is correcting some of the errors that were made on that fee schedule. And if there's any questions, uh, Mr. Serge could elaborate. So if there's something on there in red, that means an adjustment has been made. Correct. Either way, or just. Go ahead. Uh, if it's in red, it's just a change from the 2022 fee schedule. But, but is it up or down? Um, Most of them. All are the ones up. on the first page are up. They are. They're they're reflective more of what we had in 2020 when we did the 2022 schedule. We attempted to simplify things, but. Um, went too far down. So we we set a flat fee for zoning, and it just wasn't reflective of the time the zoning officer was putting in. Right. I mean, everything is getting more expensive. Our our, our staff's time, um, and so on and so forth, on these zoning issues, and they're, and and they're more complex and in that area also. So there really is no need for things to be going down. In my view, we don't need to be the high end of the scale, but I think we need to be sure that the township is being fairly compensated by developers for the time and effort that goes into the zoning process. Yeah, and I, I would follow up and just concur with what you're saying, Mr. Bennett. I, I agree. I think we don't want to burden our taxpayers with the costs of fees. 
But at the same time, we don't want to be making money off of the fees either. And I think that was what we were tasked with last year. <coughs> and my belief in looking over these changes, they look pretty minor in nature. Mm -hmm. And that's really the concept of the philosophy that we're going with, right? We're not going to burden the taxpayer. Um, and, you know, we're not going to um, unfairly overcharge right. somebody for services that we do. So I feel looking over them, they look pretty routine, you know, like you said, in today's economy, you know, that there were some slight adjustments made to a few of these, but they don't look out of line to me. Okay. Okay. So on that one, do we need a motion to adopt the fee schedule? Yes. Okay. Is there a motion to adopt the 2023 fee schedule? I'll move. A motion by Mr. Russell, second by Mr. Bennett. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion carries five to zero. Just, just for the record, I was Mr. Weaver, not Mr. Russell. Oh, sorry. That's okay. <laughs> <Good>. <laughs> All right. All right. Up next, our traffic engineer appointment. Uh, McMahon Associates. So I separated this one out of the consent agenda due to a conflict of interest of one of the board members, which is why it's separated. Okay. But it's an annual appointment that we have typically made. Okay. Any um, questions or comments on this one? Uh, any change in fee schedule? All the fee schedules are up about 5 or $10 across the board. And this one's no exception. Okay. Thank you. Any other comments or questions? Okay. Hearing none, is there a motion to appoint McMahon Associates as a township traffic engineer and accept their 2023 fee schedule? So moved. A motion for Mr. Bennett, is there a second? Second. Second for Mr. Weaver. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Abstained. Okay, motion carries four to zero with one abstention. Okay. All right, 2023 PSATS conference, April 23rd to the 26th. Voting delegate and alternate voting delegate. So Mr. Chair, I, I am always at that meeting. However, I will be representing LCATS again um, with my voting session. I do want to throw out a, a, a concept um, at our last, last uh, PSATS meeting. Um, we had a, a last minute cancel and we had Nate Sturgis cover. Um, and he's indicated, we'll get Cindy too, that he will be at the PSATS conference. And there's nothing to say that we can't have a, a staff person also be a voting delegate too. Um, so unless there's some objections to that, that would be the name I would be recommending for our voting delegate because that's someone who's being paid to be there. So we know there's not going to be a conflict or, or something like that. So, and it is important that we have voting, a person representing us. I think the other thing we should probably be doing, be doing too, uh, once the PSAS puts out the um, they put out the uh, items that are being acted upon, the different resolutions, along with the recommendation of approve or, or not approve uh, that comes from PSATs. We should, as a board, go through that list and basically present that guidance to Nate because really he's representing the board. It's the board's wishes. That's, the rep that's what anybody's role would be in that position. You're supposed to reflect your, your entire board's, the majority viewpoint of your board. So, um, so, so just so I'm clear, are we... Is it your recommendation that we designate Nate as the voting member? That's my motion. Okay. Got it. Okay. Is there any discussion? Okay. Is there a second to that motion? There is. I'll second. Okay. Second from Mr. Weaver. All those in favor of appointing Nate Sturgis as our voting delegate? Um, to PSATs, and we should also, is he the delegate, or, and we also need an alternate, correct? He is committed that he's going to be there, so I think it's, oh, I did, we had alternates as if the 
there's a chance that the Delta is not going to be there. So, well, just in case COVID or something happens, why don't we pick somebody? Somebody else want to be it? Mm -hmm. It can't be me. Okay. I, 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 I'll do it as an alternate. Okay. So, would you be willing to amend your motion? Yep. We got Tom as the alternate. Okay. And Mr. Weaver, are you good with that? Okay. Mm -hmm. All those in favor uh, to delegate um, Nate Sturgis as the voting delegate and Tom Bennett as the alternate voting delegate to the 2023 PSATS con convention, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? <coughs> Motion carries five to zero. <laughs> Up next, we have um, the supervisor committee appointments and goals. Um, I was looking over this and I think we've done a good job and I don't want to really change a whole lot up here. Um, I think the uh, only thing I, I would like to, to throw out there is I'd like to swap um, Mr. Bennett and Mr. Russell. Um, and if, if you both are up for that, Mr. Bennett, you would come to the finance committee um, and serve with me and Mr. Russell, you would go to the planning and development committee. Okay. And Mr. Bennett, are you okay with that? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, other than that, I, I think we leave them the same um, other than that change. And um, over the, uh, we can all take a look at the uh, tw board 2022 goals and maybe at our next meeting, come back and, and be prepared to discuss any changes that we wanna make to the goals um, at our next meeting unless there's something that you wanted to go over here tonight. So concerning reorganization, um, it looks like we've gotten through all of those um, agenda items. We'll move on to the regular agenda, the consent agenda. Um, for our invoices uh, and that sort of minutes, that sort of thing. Um, is there a motion to approve the consent agenda under item seven, A, B, and C? So moved. Okay. Motion um, for Mr. Bennett. Is there a second? Second. Okay. Second for Mr. Russell. I'm going to abstain on this one because I was not present um, for the approval of these minutes. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? Okay. Motion carries four to zero to one. Thank you. Mr. Russell, did you want to abstain from that one as well? Double checked. I didn't know I needed to abstain. I didn't see a special name on those invoice lists. Did I miss that? I think there's two on there. Okay. Then yes, I abstain. Yeah. Okay. So then the motion would be three would pass three zero with two abstentions. Okay. We have no new action items. Is there any old business we want to discuss? I just had a quick question. Um, up on Landis Farm there, it looks like they're redoing one of the basins there. Just what was the reason for that? I, I just happened to notice when I was driving past a couple of times. I'm guessing they're probably finalizing it. Yeah, I believe they're. Converting into the post construction. Oh, okay. I thought that was done already, but I guess they were still building houses. Any other items for under old business? Any new business? Any public comment? Okay. Well, hearing none, is there a motion to adjourn? So okay. moved. <laughs> motion by Mr. Lefevre, second by Mr. Russell. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. Aye. Okay. We will adjourn at 452 and we will not return. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.
30. Thanks, Nate. We were in a hurry. We wanted to get past the organization. Talk to Chair Larry. I'm going for three weeks. I'm going to be processing the rate of my application. And then we'll make it March. I'll see you. No, we'll we'll make sure that you're here. Thank you very much. Right. End of or beginning of February. The, um, February 16th. <laughs> Is that the okay. meeting where we come in? Not a problem. You can work around that. Thank you. Consider. Uh, I just scanned that email. I saw it came out, Tom. 